Hello everyone. In this part of this lecture, I will tell you how you can use restrictions in your fillable forms. So first, I will tell you how we can create a fillable forms. So first of all, we will go here in the file and then first we will go in file and then here you can see this is the options menu just click on this and then go here in customize ribbons and when we create a form we need to add developer menu in our menu bar so we marked it and then click on ok so now you can see in the menu bar developer menu has been added so now we can create a simple form so first of all I type here so first of all I type here first name and then give a space and I want to increment the size of this font with 14 and after this and after this I want to add here a content holder so that an user can so to add here a content holder just go repeat just go in developer tool and then you can see here this is the control panel of this menu and you can see here this is rex repeat this is re repeat this is rich text con repeat this is rich text content control and this is plain text content control and i want to use here rich text content con repeat and i want to use here rich text content repeat rich text control so i click on this and that's how we added it and now if you want to change the message inside here so i type here enter your first name and then give it some space here so this is how we added this rich text content control here and now if you want to add some restrictions in this holder then you have to go here in restrict editing just click on this and you can see here the first option is for formatting restrictions just click it and after this you can see here editing restriction if you want and if you don't want any editing restrictions then you can go here and click on yes start enforcing protection after this you have to add a password here like I am entering here a simple password and then click on ok so this is how we added this and if you want to stop this protection then you can click here so that this restrictions will be removed from this form so this is how we can add restrictions in our form so as you can see this is our design mode and if you go out from this repeat and if you want to go out from this design mode just unselect it and then you can see how we created this form so now you can save this form so just go here in file and then you can click on save and then I want to save it here in word just select it and then after this I can write the name of my form and press enter so this is how we saved our page and I hope you learn how you can add restriction in your form. So now I am going to end this video. Thank you.